Hello and welcome to the Game Shed. My name's Mark and today I've decided to pull out an absolute classic. It's Mega Man X on a Super Nintendo. This was the first Mega Man game for the uh, Super Nintendo and um, the first game in the Mega Man X series, spin-off of the original Mega Man series. In, uh, in Japan, they call this game Rockman X, which, in my opinion, Mega Man X sounds much better. <laughs> um, this was uh, first published in Japan on December 12, 1993. It was then released in America and Europe the following year, so 1994. Yeah, top game, um, obviously loved by many. It's a real sort of uh, cult game, this one. Came out on loads of different platforms. As I said, this was the uh, Super NES version. So, so here we go. Right, let's get into the action. Thought I'd just do the first level of a walkthrough here, and um, just kind of show you how to get through it. Really, only the first level, so it's not too tough. As you can see, get your gun on overdrive and make sure that you're tapping that button like crazy, because um, if you're not, then uh, you're not getting all the shots out possible. The little things you just pick up there, that's, um, that's energy. So obviously if I'd been hit at this point, that energy would have helped me out. Um, the ones in the air, just jump, shoot, jump, shoot. They only take two hits each, so give them a crack. And uh, you just got to be careful they don't smash up the floor where you want to be going, because it'll end up um, being quite tough to get past. These robots, they take a bit of shooting, but they're not too bad. So yeah, look, you can run past these ones. and. Uh, Makes them a lot easier to get past. Graphics in this game, fantastic, absolutely brilliant, obviously comic style. Um, and they really sort of, uh, really gave the Mega Man franchise, I suppose, uh, a good show in here. Kind of these miniature bosses along the way, as you can see that sort of slug thing. Just, uh, just get your button tapping going. Now I just jumped past a bit there because I've got full energy but if, you, if you've if you got no energy at this point you can jump down to the left there and there's a big energy block and uh, that'll help you out. Another one of these slug things, slug chopper, I don't know what you call it. Um, get shooting and uh, yeah pretty pretty straightforward those ones. Gotta be careful on some of the gaps because um, some of them look smaller than they actually are. And as you can see there, at this point, the floor starts crumbling as well. Just to make life that little bit more difficult. Yeah, I've got Jeremy there. <laughs> but um, yeah, just make sure you're jumping, make sure you're running fast and you get past it. Keep your guns firing because you never know what you might hit ahead of you. I kind of find there's, there's some jumpy things and flying things and stuff that you want to keep shooting and uh, just get them before they get to you really. The easiest way. That was a bit poor for me there, yeah, but... So, at this stage, I'm just running through killing these uh, flying things, but there's, there's some more exciting robots coming up. Once again, watch some of those jumps, they're a bit dodgy. And here we go, look at that, look at the cars. Blow them to smithereens. Make sure you're firing your gun early, before the car gets to you, because then you'll blow it up nicer. Or then you'll have to jump over if you don't. And again, jump over. Excellent gameplay this game. It's, you just want to keep playing it. It's brilliant. At this stage we meet the first boss. His name is Vile. Um, and before we get to him, there's some more of these cars. And they want to give us a bit of jip, so just keep shooting. You blow them up and you can jump over them. Shoot, 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 shoot. Nice. So here he is, the main man himself, Vile, in his mecha suit, mech suit, whatever you want to call it. Looking ridiculous. Basically, first time I played this, I was a bit confused. I thought this guy can't be for real. He looks too, he's too difficult to kill. But then you realise it's all part of the story. He grabs X and uh, shakes him about a bit. As you can see, you worthless piece of scrap metal. And then suddenly, boom! Along comes Zero. Oi, what do you think you're doing? Get off him. So 
So yeah, Zero makes him poop himself and fly off. Get out of it, Vile. As you can see, Mega Man X starts doubting himself, and, Vi and Zero says, "What did you expect? He's a bad man. You're not going to kill him first level, you Joker." And basically, then makes a mug of Mega Man and says, "Well, one day you could be." Even as good as me. Powerful as I am, look at that. <laughs> Cheers Zero. Thanks a lot. So anyway, Zero saved your life, so you can't really hold anything against him at that stage. And he says, See you later, X. Cheers Zero. Catch you later. Thanks for watching my video, and as is normal at this stage, I need to tell you to follow us on Twitter at game shed with two s's now we talk a lot of rubbish but we also talk a lot of good stuff and there's a lot of good people on there so get on there and do it you're gonna love it also if you haven't seen it already check out our blog on www.thegameshed2s.co.uk loads of good articles on there from myself and jamie thanks for watching bye bye